Good morning. I got a robe the other day and it feels weird. Oh, the tag's still on it. <laughs> but it feels a little bit like luxurious, like fancy, like I'm so tired. Like my boob is about to pop out at any moment. I also got these slippers. They're so cute. And like the colors together. That's so cute. Wow. I'm unreasonably tired. I started going to the gym like a week ago. It's great, like I feel better, but also I'm so fucking tired. My muscles just hurt very bad. The other day was so bad, I felt like I couldn't even do anything. I felt like my muscles were just moving through sludge very slowly. It's not the same tired as I was though before. It's like genuinely tired. I also bought my first perfume from Sephora. I got a travel size, cause perfumes are expensive. It's the Victor and Rolf flower bomb. Just thought it'd be easier to try it out and see if I like it and also cheaper. And it's so cute and tiny. It's time to make breakfast. I woke up this morning concerned. Sometimes I'll wake up with such anxiety and I woke up this morning concerned about the food I have in my fridge that's going bad soon and how I need to eat it. Like why did I wake up out of my peaceful slumber to think about this food? Specifically, I was thinking about the spinach that I need to eat because I normally only eat it in my smoothies and when I was at the grocery store, I forgot to get bananas. Crazy stuff. So how am I gonna eat the spinach? Oh. Good morning, poopers. Whoa. What do I wanna eat is the question. I have Greek yogurt I could eat, but it kinda hurts my stomach. My kitchen is a little bit messy right now. I think I might eat just like a bowl of granola with hemp seeds instead of Putting it on top of my yogurt. I really wish I was that person that like liked eating fruit because I like like three fruits and none of them are like easy fruits that you would like put in your granola or just eat for a little snack. I can eat other fruits in like smoothies, but I just want to like eat a strawberry. thrifting. It's already one o'clock. Oh my gosh. I like ate breakfast and then I laid in bed and watched Gossip Girl. He's been re-watching Gossip Girl and it's so good. It's so good. I got this locket the other day. There's nothing in it yet, but I want to put something in it. Are you all serious right now? <laughs> no, I can't fucking get over because that person wanted to just... They played that song in an episode of Gossip Girl. That's literally the only reason I'm singing it. I don't know why they played it, but it was like weird. Oh gosh. I just went thrifting. I got two big old bags for $25. And I got a little story time because I just, I hate men. Why are men the way that they are? I have this thing where if I'm out in public, I don't let, how do I explain this? Okay, so you know when you're like shopping and you're like in the aisle and there's like no one else or like you're walking straight down this way and someone tries to like go where you're at and you know, like make you move for them basically. Or like you're walking straight down and then someone else moves over and starts walking that way and like tries to make you move out of the way. Do you know what I mean? I've had people do that before. Like sometimes you'll be like looking at something specific and then like someone will get really close to you and like try to like also look at that thing and I'm like you can just wait until I'm done getting what I need to get this man I was looking at the like men's t-shirts there was no one else looking in this row so I started looking through them and then this man comes and he starts looking like right he wasn't like super close to me but like I was looking I started at this end and I was going down and I was like a little bit in and the man like was here and started looking this way so he would like collide with me at one point and he just keeps going and keeps getting closer to me and closer to me and I'm going that way 
Like I'm getting closer to him too because I was already looking that way. I already looked at all these shirts behind me. And so I was like, I'm not gonna move because I'm looking at these shirts. Like I wanted to look at these shirts. You came here and like started looking right beside me for no reason. So I just continued looking. And then he's he gets like very, very close to me. He like stops and like looks and like sighs and like looks around. And then he goes back to looking at the shirts. And then he went to like the three shirts next to the one I was specifically looking at. So he was like that close to me. He like looked at those and pushed them. He like saw that I wasn't gonna move and got mad. And so he went to the other side of me where I had already looked and started looking there and he pushed all the shirts down So that like where I was looking, you know when you're looking you have like that little bit of space You like push the shirts a little bit So he pushed them so they were all smushed so I couldn't look at the shirts anymore And I was like man, this is like you really are that privileged that you need to fucking look at my Where I'm looking right now you can just wait or look down further There was a whole other fucking huge section of men's shirts that I wasn't looking at in the same size that he could have went to first so yeah, he pushed those down and I was like, okay, so I just pushed him back and like kept looking and he had his cart like in the middle of the row of shirts and I'm not a fucking asshole like him so I didn't push the cart out of the way I just went around it and went to the other shirts I don't know if in his head he was like these are men's shirts you shouldn't be looking at these or if he just like saw that I was a girl and like wanted to like try to push me around I don't know but I was just like this is a little bit unnecessary so yeah the lesson the moral of the story is never move out of the way for a man never let a man push you around like this man was was really upset that he fucking couldn't look at the fucking small ass section of shirts I was looking at when there's a whole row he could have like I don't understand I didn't even make eye contact with him the whole time he like looked at me I'm a little I was like having a great time too no one was bothering me I actually got some weird stuff like I don't know how I'm gonna feel about it I found this coat that was really cute and I kind of kind of wish I got it but I kind of not mad I didn't get it it was like $25 I think like that's expensive for Goodwill and it was like Need to dry clean it. I'll do a haul when I get home. How much is it to dry cleaner? Whoa. I know what you know. My battery's about to die on my camera. Oh, and the funny thing is about that man, as soon as I like, left that row, he stopped looking at the shirts. Sure. Definitely. I'm home. I'm gonna do a little bit. Oh, a little, 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 little bit. Up a what? Oh, shit. My camera battery's about to die. Good morning. It's the next day. My camera died, or was dying, so I charged it. And then I kind of just forgot to film. I did a puzzle. I'll show you. I spent like six hours doing this puzzle. I don't know why it took me so long, but it's cute. Yeah, so basically, like, once I plugged my camera battery in, I was doing a puzzle for the rest of the night. But I never showed you guys what I got, so. I have this issue where I don't get out of bed. Like I woke up at nine o'clock, like 9.15 or something like that. It's now 11.16. It's two hours later and I spent the whole time in bed on my phone. First thing I got is this little like laser. It has shoulder pads. I wonder if I could like cut those out, but it's cute. It smells really weird. I don't even know what this is called. It's pink and I thought it was cute with like a little skirt. And I got this. I actually don't really know. It's just a sweater. Then I got this jacket. I was looking for like a black leather jacket and I couldn't really find anything that was like in decent condition or like looked cool. So I got this. I don't really know. It's like a weatherproof jacket. It just says weatherproof. I think that might be the company. It was $3.98, so I was like, why not get it and see if I even like it. I feel like it could be cute over like a little black dress or something. Just thought maybe. And then I grabbed this shirt when I was looking in the men's t-shirts and that man was being a man. I actually hate this shirt, but I also love it. You know those things that are like so corny and dumb, but they're borderline like funny, but not serious. You know what I mean? Like nothing I do is ever serious, you know? It says this is why I'm hot. And this is like... <laughs> I think it's, I like it. I like it actually. It's like, then I got this little black zip up sweater. It's kind of like small. I figured I could wear it to work or style it other ways. I don't know. Little black zip up. Half zip, quarter zip. That's all I got from Goodwill. Questionable, questionable. Jackets, I think I need, like it says I need to get them dry cleaned. Do I actually? Because that seems like a lot of work. Went to Dollar Tree. I really like corny Halloween stuff, like decorations and stuff. So I got a little bit of that. Got two puzzles, the one I did, and then this one I'll probably do today. <clears throat> Why did my voice Because I like puzzles. And I, it's something I can do while I'm watching Gossip Girl and not be on my phone. And then I got some cider rings. Because why not? 
not. I'm making like a little bucket with like candy and snacks and stuff. Got these orange lights. I got these like big paper clips to use as like bookmarks. I got these skeleton tongs that I'm gonna put in the bowl. Got this keep out tape, a little garland, this black creepy cloth, and then a skeleton. <laughs> oh, and then I also got the bowl that it's in. It says happy Halloween. I still haven't decorated for fall or Halloween yet. Normally I do that in like August. Oh my gosh, I forgot to tell you guys. Whoa, last night we went to Crumble Cookies and got a cookie and on the way home, this guy, this pizza, uh, not pizza, Papa John's driver was in front of us. In one lane, he was in front of us and then it switched to like two lanes but the that lane was like a turning lane and he like slowed down in front of us and then got over. I don't know what happened. I'm still like so confused about it and it's giving me so much anxiety but he like slowed down and then like looked at us and said something. I don't know if he like got over, didn't realize it wasn't a turning lane and then like we didn't let him back over but we were just driving or like what happened? <laughs> there was a car behind us that was like really close to us like riding us, like, riding our butts. It like sped up and like got over in front of the dude and like took off but then he was like behind us and he was like flat like he had his phone out the window flashing his flashlight we like kept going and then we had to get over to turn and he like pulled up beside us and was like i should fucking shoot you guys and then we like turned i don't know <laughs> what happened we weren't like close to his car or anything i don't know i'm still so confused and it's stressing me out i don't know if he was like on something but it made me so anxious like last night when we got home i was so anxious for the rest of the night because i'm like what if this dude like tries to come kill us i don't know it was freaking me out a little bit though anxiety what do i want to eat bro i swallowed both of my vitamin pills yesterday and i'm very proud because you know how many vitamins i've wasted because i can't even swallow it that sounds but I just told myself I could do it and I believed in myself and I did it. I just like don't want eggs or oatmeal. It's kinda ugly. I got the <laughs> mixed fruit spooky shapes. Spooky shapes. Weirdo. This is just for me. Like it's not, I don't even have children. I'm gonna put these rings in here so like, you know, the people that don't come over, the friends I don't have can like come and put the rings on. Kim, do you wanna wear a wing? Do you wanna wear a spider wing? You're my child. Where do I put that though? Woke up this morning with intense pains. And I think it was gas pains. I have this. It's like a little bit left. Like maybe enough for like one pancake. You have a few. You have a few. I love this shirt from H&M, if you're wondering. Can I hear it? A little bit. I think I'm constipated. <laughs> that I spilled my lactic acid like serum on the counter and I just sprayed this like directly on it. Now there's a really weird smell and I don't know if I just did some kind of chemical thing that's not good. I hope I don't die. 